Okay, you see we got some cheese, eggs, some sausages, and some biscuits. Let's see what we're going to make today. Hey guys, it's me. I'm back. And today, we are going to make a breakfast sandwich using biscuits. You know how you go to the store and you have like the Jimmy Dean's or whatever breakfast sandwiches? <laughs> well, we're going to try to attempt to make that today. See, I got my biscuits. We're going to uh, peel these in half. I got my eggs. I'm only going to use three eggs because I'm not sure if all the biscuits, if I'm going to put eggs in all the biscuits. And we got our cheese. And then if you see my seasonings right here, this is what I use to season my sausage. You don't have to uh, season your sausage, but I like to put seasoning in my sausage. I would like to thank everybody who subscribed to my channel, new and current. Anyone viewing this channel, please don't forget to hit the subscribe button, the like button, and please give me a thumbs up. Leave a comment if you wish. And then let's jump right into this video. Okay, now that our sausage is almost done, let's open up our biscuits. Double melt here on our pan. And then, you see how the whole biscuit? So then we're gonna try to find like a middle point to like go in half, you see? So now we're gonna have a top and a bottom. So this is what you do for all your biscuits. Now depending on uh, how many people that you are feeding or how many you want to make, um, then you wouldn't have to like tear these apart. But since I wanna make quite a few, then I'm gonna tear these apart and they'll probably cook even faster as well. So what, how many come in there? Eight? So let's see how many we can get out of this. So what, like 16? I don't know, let's see. Okay, we got all the biscuits laid out. We got 16 right here. Let's go ahead and preheat our oven. I'm going to put it to 375. I always bake at 375, but just go whatever your uh, your biscuit can say. It might say 350, 375, or 400, but I'm going to put mine on 375. Okay, now we're going to crack our eggs. Like I said, I'm only going to use three, three eggs in this because I'm not going to put eggs in all of them. And this one right here, I wouldn't recommend freezing i'm not sure if you can but i want to recommend freezing it um if anything like i said just make how many that that you're going to eat or that your family's going to eat and then just eat it throughout the week leave it in the refrigerator wrap it up good and then when you take out the refrigerator just let it sit out for a little bit to get like room temperature so it can heat up better in the microwave and there you go the food is done nice fast easy now we're going to whisk our eggs together i did add some pepper to our eggs okay now we're gonna add some cheese this cheese eggs is the best if you don't like cheese you don't have to add cheese you can put any amount of cheese you want in there like there's no exact science or measurements to this so this is all trial and error and we're gonna see how this works Okay, we got our eggs cooking. Oh, I did put some butter, add some butter to the pan. Our sausage has cooled down so it will be easier to touch. And as soon as these eggs get done, we're going to assemble our breakfast biscuits. Okay, the eggs is done. Let's get ready to assemble. Okay, let's assemble. You're going to put some of your sausage mixture inside your biscuit. And then take some eggs. Okay. And then we're going to put our top on it. It'll be just like uh, one of your uh, sandwiches that you get from like, I guess like McDonald's and like from the supermarket. This way you've got your own and it probably tastes even better. But, like I said, I don't know if all the eggs is going to go on all of them. If not, I'm going to put just cheese 
a cheese um, and biscuit sausage. So let's do another one. And like whatever sausage that you have left over, you can do whatever you want with it. Like, I don't know, make some more or just make a different kind of breakfast for another day. And also with this, you can also make like grits on the side if you want or some hash browns. Or if you just want to eat like the breakfast sandwich and that'll be fine as well. But let's get these all done. Okay, now that we got these all assembled and ready to go into the oven. You see, I still have some left so I can do something with that like later on or just pop open another biscuits or just use it tomorrow or whatever. But we're going to get these in the oven. And then we're going to let them cook. And then I'm going to clean up the kitchen and then I'll be back. Okay, so when I was about to put the food away as I was cleaning, I was thinking, let me just crack open another can of biscuits and then use the rest of the sausages and then just make sausage and cheese biscuits. Just in case maybe you don't want to eat a sausage, egg, and cheese biscuit, then that way you can just eat a sausage and cheese biscuit. So let's get this in the oven. Okay, our breakfast breakfast biscuit <laughs> oh breakfast oh my god sorry our breakfast breakfast biscuit egg and cheese and sausage is done and our breakfast biscuits sausage and cheese is done so let us uh take a look a taste and see how it is all right this one is the uh sausage egg and cheese now i usually like to put um like oh, some jelly on mine, grape jelly, because I like it. But if you don't like grape jelly or a different kind of jelly, you can add that to it as well. Or just don't have no jelly at all. But let's just try it. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And the biscuits are done inside and out. All around. See that? Look at that. Mm -hmm. Nice and cold. Oh, man. Mm. Mm, mm, mm. So, if you like, go ahead and try this recipe. See how you like it. See how your family likes it. Leave a comment down below if you plan on making this. And if you do make it, please let me know how it turned out. I want everybody to stay safe and say have a good day. See you later. Bye.